Hi, this is uh, Ampeg SVT4 Pro and in my opinion it's a very very interesting amplifier because of I discovered the crossover section on this one and that's what makes the whole thing very very interesting. The SVT4 Pro also has five preamp tubes like 12 AX7 and one AU7. So this is a real uh, tube preamp section. I mean five tubes. Who else has five tubes in the preamp section? Preamp section. The amplifier is something like 1,800 watts. If you put it in bridge, but when you use it stereo, like I use it, it's like something like 300 watts per speaker. <laughs> Okay, let's look at the crossover. It's good to start from the bottom end, so it's something like 50 Hz. Of course, it's not very useful in live situations because we have so low frequencies. But let's put it a little bit higher. I think in a live situation, we can leave it somewhere like uh, 250, 300 Hz. And this is very good for a 5-string bass, so you keep the low end safe. Now the low end comes from the 15-inch speaker. Let's look at the high end. We start from, we don't want to have that sound, we need to mix some low end too. But you know, we don't need so much high end, so let's start with the low. Now it's something like 250, 300, and we start to add slowly the high end. been wondering why and how a lot of those first-class pro bass players sound so good and so fast when they play with the pumping style or, or, or tapping that's because many of them use the crossover so they keep the low end safe and then you can add whatever you want to the high end you can put reverb or something but the low end is also always there and the bass player needs low end Let's now look at the back of the SVT4 Pro. So when you use it like mono bridge, you get 1600 watts, you connect it like a bridge and you get all the full power. But if you start, want to use it like I did with a crossover, then you put this one in the channel B and the other one channel A. Now we have both speakers separate. Then we use small cables like a guitar cable with it channel B, that's high end, connect it to the high end, high end is connected, and then we have the low. So it's very simple. Before you needed to use all kind of preamps, power amps, sometimes even two power amps to connect it and to have a real two-way system, but with this SVT4 Pro, it's very simple. Only two cables and you put them separate and you have an excellent crossover in the amplifier.